What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Emerald walkthrough. Okay, so, in our last episode, we managed to defeat, or just, I don't even know, find out what Team Aqua's all about. We just found out what Team Man was all about, saw a legendary Pokemon, but we didn't see the legendary Pokemon for Aqua. So, what we're gonna do now, is we're gonna go straight to, hmm, Moss Deep City, that's right, yeah, we're going to Moss Deep City. <laughs> Screw this place. Let's go. So, after, you know, taking care of the, t the whole Team Aqua situation right here in Pokemon Emerald, uh, you can see that no Wilmer are blocking the way, the only way to get to Moss Deep City, and yeah, I know. It's gonna be a nice adventure, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use a few uh, repels right here because I don't want to get attacked by any of these Pokemon right here. So, let's get this. Let's do this. Bring it. Alright. Let's get it. So there we go, guys. Moving on to Route 124 right here. We got a double battle waiting for us right there. Maybe a singles battle. So what we're going to do is I'm going to switch it up. I am going to go with Shroomly and New Sebat right here. That's right. We've got a few more days before the original or the uh, new Mortal Kombat game comes out. That's, that's what I'm looking at. That's right. And here we go. This guy, he's like swimming on his lumps himself. Whatever. Okay. So here we go. We got Speedo Torpedo and uh, Hadi Tutari. Here we go. And uh, they're coming out with some water type Pokemon right here. And that one, that one's a scary one right there. That Gyarados, that's a scary one. Oh, God. Oh, Jeebus. Oh, yeah, we're going to have some fun right here. And of course, Gyarados' Intimidate lowers our defense or our attack for a little bit. So, luckily for us, we got Thunderbolt and we got Giga Drain for this guy right here. So, let's get that. Eat it. Come on, that's quadruple damage since somehow you're a flying type Pokemon too. That's right. No more Gyarados right there. Everybody's getting experience points. And the Giga Drain. Just to add insult to injury right here. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, nearly defeats Meryl. And, uh. Okay, what is this Meryl gonna do? Double edge. And it looks like it's gonna faint. No, it's not gonna faint. Alright, okay. Aerial Ace. And uh, you know what? Let's just go with Sky Uppercut right there. I love that Sky Uppercut. It's pretty fun. It's a pretty fun move. As you can see, that's right. Defeated you, Grace and Declan. De Declan, Declaner. Whatever. Now, let's see. Nobody gives us our phone number right here. Now, this is a very, very wide place. Of course, this is the second part of the ocean area. As you can see, got a buttload of uh, area right here. Look at that. Just a lot of area right here, which will uh, eventually lead up to us going to Moss Deep City right here. Now, if we take a close-up, yeah, uh, darker area right here, that usually means we have to go dive and all that stuff. So, we're going to try and make it an adventure right here on our way to Moss Deep City. And then, uh, well, as you probably already know, we, yeah, we went all the way right here. That That's nothing in comparison to what we're going through right now. So, let's go back and uh, take care of this thing right here. So... Let's see what we can find. As you can see, uh, the way you'll be able to dive is through finding any area with a dark spot right here in the ocean. And of course, we don't have the dive technique or anything like that. So we're gonna, we're just gonna have to be doing our adventure the old-fashioned way, going up and down, seeing who we can find. And look at that, we found ourselves another a double battle right here. I'm just gonna stick with the same people, and they're not looking at me. Pay attention to me. So here we go. My big sister is tough at Pokemon. Don't cry when you lose. All right. Usually when they say, don't cry, that means they're going to cry. So here we go, little sis and bro, Lila and Roe, coming out with the Shinchao and uh, Kurvana. That's right, Shinchao coming out. Alright. So let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Um, Thunderbolt. And Giga Drain. Best Pokemon for this, uh, best Pokemon for this, uh, this situation right here. Look at that, Carvana defeated easily. And uh, yeah, this is a very, very good place to actually train. As you can see, new Cybot grows to level 38. And uh, we're going to go with the Giga Drain right here. Look at that. Giga Drain. And somehow that Shinchao just survives. Truly, you're kind of losing your touch right there. And uh, there's that Flail attack, and it takes a nice amount. Um, let's go with the Slash attack right here. Slash attack wins it. There we go. There we go. Alrighty. Okay. 
And, uh, well, that's another victory for us. And, yeah, he, he's probably not crying, but his sister's probably chewing him out. And, uh, yes, I will battle you again. You know, just for the hell of it. Alrighty. Okay, so, let's see. Um, moving on forward right here. I'm going to be going up and down this whole area right here, guys, because, as you can see, it's a lot of ocean. Lots and lots of ocean right here. And uh, th that guy's going to be waiting for us. So, let's go ahead and switch him out to Skyblade right here. All right, here we go. Hey, are you lost at sea? If you can beat my Pokemon, I can serve as your pilot. Not really lost. Just looking for battles, that's all. That is all. And here we go, Speedo Torpedo Spencer coming out with his tentacle. And uh, did I make the right choice? Yes, I did. Yeah, poison attacks won't work. All right, here we go. Air Cutter for the win. Come on. This, well, it doesn't really destroy tentacle. Alright, let's see. What can we do right here? Oh, wow. He's rapping on me. But, you know, luckily for me, I do have uh, wings of knives or knives of wings or something. I don't even know how to... Feathers of wings or knives. <laughs> wow. Miss Missing my stuff. And then look at that. Skyblade grows to level 37. That's good. And he's going to be coming out with a wingle. So let's go ahead and uh, go to Swamp Lord. It's been a while. I know, same typing and all that stuff. But Swamp Lord needs to grow some more levels. It's a level 41. It's a little too low for this part, right? Is it? Is it? It is. So let's see. Here we go. Take down attack. Hopefully for the win. And uh, there we go. Wingle destroyed like that. Uh-huh. Look at that. And uh, Spencer's not too happy. He's like, I lost my bearings in the battle. I wonder what they mean when they say that. All right. Um, you know what? Let's go ahead and talk to him. Many people lose their bearings at sea. If you're that sort, you should refer to the PokéNav map, which, well, I do have. And there goes that repel. Now, I'm going to use another one because we don't want to get... Uh, we don't want to get into another battle right here. All right, so let's see. Going downstairs. And nothing, just the rock. So, like I said, I'm going up and down because there's going to be trainers left and right. And I kind of want to battle every single one of them. And here we have another beauty. And she's like, if you if you just float in the sea like this, Pokemon come around and play. All right. Let's see. Let's do this. Bring it on. So here we go. A swimmer Jenny wants the battle, and she's coming out with her Whalmer. This looks fun. All right, Skyblade. Let's do this. Skyblade. Let's go with the fly attack. And uh, well, that missed attack is not really going to do much for you. It really, is it? Okay. All right. Here we go. Fly attack. Fly attack takes it, and a Whalmer just survives all right all right okay so we're trapped in a vortex right here skyblade you should stay calm right here now let's go right ahead and use that air cutter and it missed wow okay so we're kind of we're kind of in trouble right here just a little bit and uh, yeah we're getting attacked attacked a lot come on air cutter no <laughs> come on oh you suck Wilmer you suck all right. Okay. I see how this is. Let's go. Air cutter. Hopefully for the win. And there goes that Wilmer. Don't mess with my Skyblade. That's right. And Jenny's defeated. She's like, oh darn, I've lost it. I've gone and lost. Yes, you have. Okay. And yeah, she wants to battle me again someday. That's pretty cool. All right. Um, moving up right here. You, you, you're going to see different spots in the ocean. You know, one may lead you to another place, like, like upstairs right here. And you know to the other place I think as you can see there's a lot of spots and a lot of uh, a lot of areas right here where you can uh, actually walk around you can fish too which is awesome and uh, let's see I'm gonna use my I'm gonna use my item finder because there might be an item right around here somewhere and there's nothing okay so this is just a sp uh, spot to just fish and uh, let's see we got nothing right there more repel oh god we're gonna have to buy like a mega repel or something a max repel Alright, and there's nothing, and there's a guy that wants to battle us, so let's go ahead, ahead and switch our Pokemon first. This guy is getting uh, beaten right there, and uh, let's go with Shroom Lee. Shroom Lee, needs, Shroom Lee needs to grow more levels, and this guy right here is like, foo -foo 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 -foo. I dive deep underwater to go deep undercover. Plumbing the depths is where I excel. 
Alright, okay. Alright. Let's see what we got right here. His name is Chad. He's coming out with a tentacle. So I'm somewhat of a disadvantage. It is a poison type Pokemon, but you know, here we go. It's strength. Strength attack does it. Tentacle has been defeated. How about that? How about that? Skyblade doing its thing. And I'm just gonna stay like that. Shroomly. Wait, did I call him Skyblade? Wow. Wait, Skyblade does have the experience here. Wow. No wonder I saw its name. Alrighty, so here we go. Giga Dream Attack. And uh, Wilmer nearly defeated right there. Oh, God. And here comes that Water Pulse. Hopefully we don't get confused. I don't want to get confused. That's always been my bad luck right there. So here we go again. Giga Drain. Alrighty. Alrighty. There we go. How about that? Getting some HP like that. Bye bye Wilmer. And, uh... Alright, okay, so that's another one. He's like, glub, 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 I'm sinking. Okay. I'm not going to save you, buddy. I am not. And, uh, yeah, there's more double battles right there. Now, if I go down right here, where does that take me? Let's see. No, yeah, that's going to take me to the border of, uh, Sutopla City right here. Unfortunately, we can't go there right now because we don't have the surf or we don't have the, di the dive, but we're very, very close to Moss Deep City right here. Alrighty. Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. What should I do next? What should I do next? Uh, you know what? Shroomly. Shroomly should be in the front. And you know what? Let's go with Swamp Lord right here. The dynamic Nuo right here. So let's go downstairs. And there we go. Hmm. You're ready any Pokemon instead of swimming you yourself. I am envious. Okay. I'm not going to lose to some surfer trainer. All right. Okay. A lot of these people have egos. Just egos. Here we go. Roland and Isabella. Isabella. Here we go. Taking a drink right now. I'm taking a nice, a cool water drink. And uh, let's go with that Giga Drain right here. And uh, you know what? Let's go with Secret Power. See what that does. Well, it does that surf attack. And. Uh, Technically, it's not a water type book or not a water type attack if we use a surfing technique or secret power, but it only hits one Pokemon. And that bubble beam just hits me. But here we go, Giga Drain. I wish Giga Drain could just like recover or recover both Pokemon. That would be awesome. Alrighty, there we go. Let's get it. That's right. And everybody's happy, right? Everybody's happy. Oh, I can't. I've only got sweat in my eyes. I'm not crying. You are. You pretty much are crying right now. Alright, so moving on forward right here. This will lead us to... Well, back up top. Alright, okay. And uh, let's see. What do we do? What do we do? Ah, more Pokemon trainers right here. We're in Route 126, which is the area where Sutopolis is at. So let's see where we're at. Yeah, we're at Route 126. We're going to have to save this for later on, guys. Not going to battle those guys. We're going to go back up right here, Route 124, and move on to, um, to Moss Deep City right here. So we're going to go... Let's see. What do we do right here? I think I missed, a, I missed out on a house. Yes. Now, if you talk to this guy, the Hunter's House, if you have... Or if you found shards, you will be able to trade him. You'll be able to get uh, elemental stones for shards. He's like, I'm the diving treasure hunter. I'm the awesome dude who makes deep sea dives to gather treasures resting at the bottom. You don't, you haven't got any treasure for me? If you see any shards like red shard, you've got to trade it with me. Of course, the color of the shard, he'll give you the elemental stone for. Red shard, of course, happens to be fire stone. Um, and so on and so forth. So if you guys are looking to evolve any of your Pokemon uh, with elemental stones, yes, this is the guy to go. Now, what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to keep on going. And uh, let's see, let's see. Well, it looks like we're in Moss Deep City right here. Yes, we are Moss Deep City. And I think those are Pokemon trainers, so we're not going to end this episode right now with nothing. Wait, no, those are not Pokemon trainers. These guys teach you moves, I think. I can't do this anymore. It's utterly hopeless. I'm a fighting type trainer, so I can't win at the Moss Deep Gym no matter how hard I try. Urgh, punch, 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 punch. Wait, wait, don't you look at me that way. I'm not hitting the ground. Or do you want me to treat to teach your Pokemon dynamic punch? 
Dynamic Punch is a pretty cool, a very good move. Um, two Pokemon can learn it. Uh, let's see. Let's go with Swamp Lord right here. Let's see what it, what it has. Let's see. Dynamic Punch. What should have forgotten? As you can see, Dynamic Punch. It's a 50/50 kind of uh, kind of move, fighting type move, and uh, unfortunately. It confuses your Pokemon or yeah any of your opponent's Pokemon so I'm gonna teach it dynamic punch for just right now yeah for, for right now I'm just gonna teach it I'm gonna take away muddy water and uh, yeah I'm gonna take away muddy water water for that one right there so one two three swamp lord forgot muddy water and here it is the Dyna dynamic punch and uh, I want you to win at the Moss Steve Gym using dynamic punch well we'll try we shall try now. I, I think this guy teaches us another move. Ah, it feels great le letting the waves wash over my feet. Speaking of the waves, you you know that uh, an island city ca uh, called uh, Sutopolis. I think the gym leader there had a new leader come in. People tell me the new leader once mentored Wallace. Okay, so this is just a little bit of a tidbit of uh, what to expect later on. Because yes, technically speaking, in Hoenn. Wallace is the gym leader of these of the Sutopla City Gym. Unfortunately, in this one, or I don't know, fortunately, he I think he made that switch. But we will eventually find out in our in our later adventures right here. So what we're gonna do is yeah, we're gonna stay put right here, guys. Stay tuned in the next episode. We're gonna be taking a small tour of Moss Deep and then I don't know, maybe take a visit uh north from here. Battle some more Pokemon trainers, you know, not leave you guys hanging and all that stuff. See you guys. Thank <laughs> you.